Good morning travellers, welcome to Changi Airport Terminal 3. I am so excited this morning because it is the time of the year where I travel again and this time round I'm going to a destination other than Malaysia. And guess what? Yes, this is our yearly routine where we are going back to Club Med but this time round will be Club Med Bali. So join me as I await my family members who are going to arrive here at Changi Airport Terminal 3 for the check-in process. Catch you later. Bye! Today, we are taking Garuda Indonesia to Bali this morning. Garuda Indonesia is a full-service airline that operates daily flights from Singapore's Changi Airport to Bali International Airport. The flight time is a short 2 hours and 30 minutes on the single-hour Boeing 737-800 series aircraft. It's quite a full flight today as this is the June holiday season. Walking down the Arrow Bridge always brings a smile to my face because it's the start of another exciting flight journey. Especially so, this time with my family members. The boarding process this morning was smooth. However, we spent 30 minutes taxiing the entire airport before departure. Let me give you a seat tour. Today, I'm seated at row 35C. The tray table is easily accessible and can be further extended. The seat pitch is very comfortable for a short flight and it comes with a soft pillow and fluffy blanket. It's really unfortunate that the in-flight entertainment system was down for seats on the left side of the aircraft. I love aircraft with adjustable air vent as boarding can be quite warm. Reading lights can be found above you too. The toilet was averagely clean and it came with a nappy changing table, facial tissues, light perfume, air sickness bag and a wash basin. Of course, not forgetting the coat hook. While we get ready for departure, the cabin crew took their position for pre-flight safety demonstration. Being a full-service airline, Garuda Indonesia offered two meal options on this flight. Fried beef noodles or chicken with rice. For this trip, I ordered a special meal. The seafood meal came with a dory filet with potatoes served with pumpkin salad and fruits. It's really not bad. One travel hack is that if you order special meal, you would be served first. The pilot made the announcement for landing shortly after 2 hours. Overall, this is a short and comfortable flight. Cabin crew members were friendly. However, I wish they could have informed us earlier and did some service recovery regarding the in-flight entertainment system. If you are looking for a cost-effective and efficient way to travel from Singapore to Bali, Garuda Indonesia GA843 flight can be a good option. Do remember to subscribe and follow if you enjoy content like this. Do stay tuned to the next video on my Clubmate experience here in Bali. Bye!